<laughs> Let me make the way downstairs. So I want to go across the street to Subway. Instead, I'm going to encounter some stuff. <laughs> Lights, camera, Hollywood's in the DF dub. Like I said, if I can get across the street. <laughs> but they're filming a movie. Uh, Stephen King's book, 1123-63, it was all about the uh, JFK assassination. And you are looking at the classic cars that they're using in this movie. And some of them, as an old taxi, this is an old Studebaker. The car that they're people, I'm going to see if I can swing around. <laughs> see if I can get around here, sneak across. I'm not the only person filming. Channel 5 is doing stuff here today. Johnny Archer. Hey, I <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> well, he made a cross. Battery's getting low, so I'm going to need to find <laughs> and over there is a classic green looking, I said about 1940 Chevy over there. Well, let me explain further about this movie as I go inside here. Because I need to get to, uh... <laughs> let me shut it down for a moment. Okay. I'm going to pass by Subway, but I'm going to show you what it looks like, and wow, she's an extra in the movie, she does. <laughs> My... <laughs> I think they're on break because some of the extras in this movie, but I'm going to go downstairs and show you another angle of what's going on. Woo! <laughs> Highlight. Wow and wow. Look at there. 1964 Chevy Impala convertible. And a dude running right in the underneath. <laughs> These are the type of cars that people are using for this movie. And it's a mini series. And I'm going to tell you who's in it. James Franco. Well, an actor done some stuff. Uh, Josh Dumal. And by the way, this is a police car that they're using in the movie. And has a rusty old Chevy pickup uh, over there. And, oh, and somebody else is in this movie um, that's near and dear to my heart. Michael Keaton. Batman's in the movie. <laughs> Yes! See, there's an old Ford pickup, and there's a classic Buick Electra over there, so it's... <laughs> beautiful cars over here. I can't, this is about as far as I can get. Well, at least I'm going to show you. <laughs> You're looking at a... A Jeep camera over there. <laughs> right there on the corner of... Uh, of uh, Elm and Houston Street and there's a classic 1960s Ford Thunderbird and there's another car over there that's a classic 1940s type uh, how you doing? 1940s type Dallas police car over there <laughs> so a lot of, a lot of buzzing going around here in downtown Dallas today and of course early on today a few hours ago on Elm Street, gridlock like crazy. <laughs> People couldn't get around. And if you're traveling, if you're trying to come on to Dallas, trying to hit the I-35, uh, good luck with that. Good luck with that. <laughs> because uh, they're going to swing you back around to like somewhere. I'm not sure how you're going to get on to 35, heading out to Fort Worth. But uh, figure it out. <laughs> Man, across the way, a whole lot of people are staring and looking and kind of 
kind of in awe of what's going on. I think there's a break in the action here in the taping, and you can see, oh, yep, I'm beginning to hear that they're about to restart. So I'm going to shut it down for now. But you just saw a little taste of what's going on here in downtown Dallas as they're filming the Stephen King book about the JFK assassination, 1122. 263 is the name of it. Warner Brothers has got this place all blocked off. <laughs> and they're filming for three days. Today, tomorrow, and Thursday. And I'll let you know when this movie is going to be filmed. When it's going to come up on, uh, on television. It's a miniseries made for TV. And uh, here's and about to start up, so I'm gonna get back inside. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting hungry. So I'll just keep it right there. So that this is what they're doing. And there's a uh, there's a TV uh, camera crew from uh, Telemundo 39 taping as well. So here's the thing about the, the uh, Stephen King book. What if JFK? survived the assassination. If you read it, you pretty much know what it is. If you haven't, you might want to get the book. It's still pretty much uh, available. And uh, I'll let you know when that uh, mini-series airs. Probably around the time of the assassination or something like that. So, you're getting a good look of what's going on today in Dallas. Lights, camera, and uh, Hollywood. Now, oh, by the way, this is not the only project that's being filmed here in Dallas. There's a TV show for Fox, it's called The Woman from the South, and somewhere in downtown Dallas today, Kanono Reeves is walking around. He, the hook for him being in town has something to do with the Neiman Marcus catalog, so lots of stuff, and oh yeah, watch your step. And that's a little peek of what's going on here in Dallas, right here on the Donnie Sport Movie Mix. We're taking a little bit inside of how movie making's done, and how you can create Ritlock in downtown Dallas during the week. <laughs> Lots of fun.